How do you respond to a compliment? It might sound simple, but it's actually not as straightforward as you might think. In fact, if you look around, you'll notice that most people are actually really uncomfortable, you know, when, they're, when they receive a compliment. And you'll probably notice them doing one of four things. They'll either dismiss, devalue, redirect, or deny a compliment, all of which is a mistake. So before we talk about what you should do when you get a compliment, let's talk about what not to do. The important thing to realize is when somebody gives you a compliment, they're bringing you a gift. They're giving you a gift of their attention because first they paid attention to you, they noticed you, and they noticed something about you that they appreciated, and they also are giving you a gift of letting you know about that. So when you get a gift, don't dismiss it. That's a really nice shirt you got on there. Um, this whole thing, nah, I got it on sale. See, you just dismissed that gift. Don't devalue it. You have such beautiful eyes. I bet you say it to all the girls. <laughs> you see, you just devalued that gift. Just because that person may or may not have, you know, given that gift to others, it doesn't mean that what they gave you is of no value. Don't devalue it. Don't redirect it. You have such beautiful eyes. Oh, thank you. You do. You have great eyes yourself. You see, you just re-gifted that gift that was given to you, and that's not what the person wanted. They wanted for you to receive it, not to gift it right back to them. And most importantly, don't deny it. I really enjoyed your play piano playing. You're so talented um, as a pianist. Ah, uh, no, I'm not really. I'm, I'm, I'm really just, I'm not a good play piano player. Really, you know, I, I, I really enjoyed your piano playing. Pfft, yeah, I, I practice sometimes. You're just probably being polite, you know. You see, by denying that compliment, you're forcing the person to argue that the gift is actually real and so much so that they'll probably regret bringing it in the first place. So don't do any of those things. Well, and, and then what should you do? You should do what you should do when you get any gift. You gratefully receive it and you say thank you. And by doing that, you actually are giving the other person a gift of your gratefulness and appreciation. So when somebody says, that's a really great shirt you got on there, you might say, thank you, I really like it myself. Or, um, great eyes, thank you, that's a really kind thing for you to say. Um, you're such a great piano player, thank you, that means a lot. Or simply, thank you. And when you say that, don't just say it on a verbal channel. Be sure to include your body language and energy. Don't forget the other two channels of communication. But when on all three channels of communication, when you say thank you, that really makes the gift giver, the person who gave you the gift of their compliment, feel good about that. And uh, that way, you give them a gift also. I thank you for the gift of your attention today. And uh, if you liked it, share it with your friends uh, and hit the like button and uh, stay tuned for more communication tips.